two teams sat through a longer than usual 30 minute wait but we're back in action here in the Super Bowl and they'll start this drive just across the 30 pretty nice work on the return over first and 10 Coming to the line here to begin their next drive, the Seahawks offense. And the turnover last time, that's sort of been symptomatic of their struggles here in this one. Good work. Oh, down, and it's picked up by the Ravens. And this is going to be brought back for the Baltimore touchdown. And what we just saw, very, very rare. We only had five of those in the first 50 Super Bowls. The biggest stage, the biggest game, and we just saw it happen again. Extraordinary. The defense has been good, and they were good again there. Tucker able to connect on the extra point. And the lead will swell by one more. From the 10. And they'll start this drive just across the 30. Pretty nice work on the return. The Seahawks Coming to the line here to begin their next drive, the Seahawks offense. -yard line. And they weren't on the sidelines for long, but I'll tell you what, I'm glad you and I weren't down there. We Wilson hit. It's loose. It's out. Fumble. That's the third time he's fumbled so far in this game. And, you know, you can make excuses for each and every one of them. But the bottom line is, he's got to take care of it better. And now that he's shown a propensity for fumbling, just a with the fumbles are trying to do. Yeah, well, guys take one fumble, two. So, oh, my goodness, three or more. Wow. Just doesn't make any sense, does it? They'll try and run for one first and goal. And he will take it in for a Ravens touchdown. Just a great play there with his third touchdown of this Super Bowl. And the Ravens have used the short field to their advantage as they cash in for six. Tucker with the extra point. And that will extend this big lead. Tucker now to kick it away following the touchdown. the 10 and he won't quite make it to the 25 on the return the Seahawks take over first and 10 coming to the line here to begin their next drive the Seahawks offense they are looking to make a bit of a 180 they are sputtering right now and frankly I think it's time to call your playmakers together and say all right guys we're gonna lean on you through this patch we need you to get us back on track and get us going in the right direction so you're calling plays geared to them not necessarily what you look at your plays oh this hurts the defense oh my goodness he loses it again is not free but a teammate comes along and scoops it up almost like it's almost like baseball guys at bat people are on base in scoring position one guy doesn't get them home the next guy comes through and picks him up and avoids the turnover the passing windows are just not there and that's just another example of how great this defense has been all game long and that's exactly what a top 10 defense can do they can really change the game tempo and frustrate you as you try to execute offensively Turn of 12 following a very nice punt. After and the offense will take over with a new set of downs. Now out comes their leader and the captain of this offense. The Raven offense set at the line for this next drive. Now a handoff here to his running back. And a loose football. The ball comes out and the Seahawks have recovered. Now we're going to get a timeout here as it looks like there's a Seahawk injured on the play. We'll check on his status when we get back. Coming up on second and seven. They'll start by running the option to the right. And the second wave of tacklers is going to get him as they stop him behind the line. Now they're going to be dealing with a third and seven. Is that one officially a loss of one? Hard on the play. Brings up third and seven. And a pretty nice. 
nice tackle there, ranging up from his free safety spot as he'll stop him about a yard short. It's a six-yard gain, and it leads him looking at a fourth down. Boy, a call like this, certainly tougher to make in a Super Bowl, but they'll go for it on fourth down. Decided to hit it off that time on the run-pass option. Appeared to be an easy decision. Just gave it inside. Nice, steady gain. A big roll of the dice on fourth and one, but it pays off. They convert. At the 44-yard line. He's going deep for Brown. And a scary incompletion. Almost picked off. It would have been their first INT of the game. Instead, second down. Incomplete. And he'll give it here to his running back. Great strong move, but he'll still be stopped shy of midfield. Four yards the gain, and it'll bring up a third down. He's, that's caught inside the 20. And he will have the Ravens first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. So the big play means just like that, they'll operate from the red zone now on first down. Dancing to his right. Inside the 10 at the 8. Give him 10 that time, escaping the danger, running with it, and picking up a first down. First and goal at the 8-yard line. And to give this time to the tailback. And he is into the end zone for a ball to a touchdown. A great effort there with a record fourth Super Bowl touchdown tonight. And this offense is running away with this one. And that rushing touchdown, his fourth, puts him just one shy of the NFL record in a single game. And we all know he would love to get to that record and even beyond it, but he doesn't need to in order to impress in this one, does he? What a, what a performance. What an absolute great game that he's had here in this one. And out a little across the 25 to the 27. Rashad Penny on the return. The Seahawks take over first and 10. Coming to the line here to begin their next drive, the Seahawks offense. They have been struggling. I would imagine at halftime they went through some possible changes. Well, those changes aren't working, so now where do you go? I think that now it's much more in their head. And what I mean by that is just what you said. You've gone over the changes. I bet they were pretty clinical at the half, not too emotional. They might need to go to the emotional side because you've got to find something, some spark somewhere. And so far, just being calm hasn't exactly worked. They need any spark at this point. They head to the line facing a third and seven following the incompletion on second down. Here's Carson with a catch out of the backfield. Two words that we hear coaches say all of the time. One starts with a B, one starts with an S. Ball security. And they preach it. They, they have it up in, in the meeting rooms, right? You see the signs. They talk about it all the time. But still, when you've got defenders out there who are preaching, hey, we're going to take the ball away from you, no matter what position you play, you've got to take care of the rock. Five brings up second and five. And he's going to find his man out of the back. Field. That's complete. It'll be a two-yard gain. Complete two and they're going to have a third down. And he gets the first down yardage he needs before he's brought down at the six. in for six. Tucker able to connect on the extra point, and the lead will swell by one more. Seahawks, nothing. Justin Tucker. Tucker now to kick it away following the touchdown. From the 10. And takes this near the 25. Just a little pass there. Call it the 26. over first and 10. Coming to the line here to begin their next drive, the Seahawks offense. 
they are right now just ice cold. I mean, they have struggled big time in this game, and they're getting blown out. How do they adjust? So tough because we always talk about it being a team game, and you need all 11 working well together. But every now and then, partner, you need that one guy who can make a play against all odds that maybe can ignite things. And I think that's what they're looking for right now. Yeah, you talk about going to your playmakers. They probably need to do it. Find someone that you're used to touching the football that makes big plays and give them that opportunity to maybe wake up everyone else. That's a 45-yard line. Carson will take the handoff out of the option play. And he works his way forward for about four up to the midfield stripe. He was taken to the run got four. Now they deal with a second and six. A gain of four. It's now second and six. From midfield now, here's Wilson. And he finds his man, the tight end Olsen. Still in search of their first touchdown of the game, but they're on the move. First and ten. From the gun, it's Wilson. That was a route run, not just with dexterity, but with intelligence. Found the hole in the zone, made sure the quarterback saw him, and was able to make the sure catch and put the down marker back to one. Wilson, after the play fake to Carson. He's got the first down here inside the 30. And down to the 28-yard line. A gain of 13, it's a first down. And nowhere to fit that football in. It's knocked away and incomplete. The former first-round pick, Marlon Humphrey, there to get a hand on it. Again on second and 10, it's Wilson. And this is caught off a deflection. They do get a couple, but they'll be left staring at a third and eight coming up. Wilson now to throw on third down. And that is incomplete. He's had trouble finding open receivers all game, CD, and that's because really there hasn't been many. This defense has been all over it. Yeah, they're one of the better defenses in the league, and every time I talk to someone around the NFL, they all say the exact same thing. They're so fundamentally sound, it's hard to execute against them. Ravens, 90. Seahawks. I'm kind of surprised by that, that they kicked the field goal. I guess you get some points, but this deficit third quarter, I don't know. Yeah, I don't either. Yeah, I'm with you on that one. You're down that much, kicking a field goal. Does it feel a little bit maybe waving the white waving flag? The white. You just, just want to get that. out of here? Yeah, I, I think you got to go ahead and try to get some bigger points on the board. The Raven offense set at the line for this next drive. A throw left side to start the drive is complete. And he gets this up across the 35 before he's out of bounds. Give him nine there on the first down completion. One quarter remains here in the Super Bowl. Second and one.